Welcome to AKB Bags. My name is Andrea and you're joining me in the Babe Cave. Today I am in a collaboration. The first one of my channel. Yeah! So uh, it is uh, started by Yoda Style. She threw out the challenge uh, and I accepted. And it's basically carrying the same tote or bag of your choice for one whole week, which is a lot to ask for for a purse lover <laughs> because we change them constantly. So this challenge, um, I'm gonna be linking seven or eight other people, which I will get my list here. Um, Geoda Style, Don Loves Couture, Cami from Cami's Closet, Eva from Fuchsia Floyd, Pocketbook Huntress, Melissa's Closet, Yoshia Lux, and James Jam. So all of their links will be in the description bo box below. So you'll check out their videos after you see what's in my bag. So this is the bag. And let me do a quick spin. So if you're interested in seeing what is in this bag, then stay tuned. So I decided on a coach bag and it's a bag that I have yet to carry and it is the pebble leather, as you can see with the turn lock um, chain tote and hence the chain with the leather straps. So I of course found a new charm and it says love, you know, for val Valentine's. And basically I'm gonna give you a spin of it and there's no back pocket. Um, first time using it and for a week and so I was itching to get out of this thing but um, let me go through the front is a turn lock right here and inside there it's a small slender pocket and I have gum upside down I have butter rums lifesavers amazing okay a few more butter rum lifesavers remember this is from a week so I have accumulated some items from the past week so, oh, and it has, I forgot to mention, it has this cool hang tag. It's upside down. <laughs> and it is a gold hang tag, unlike the leather hang tag. So I thought that was a neat touch. I got this at Marshall's. I got it for $89, I want to say. Um, so I forgot to mention that. This is really telling me if I want to carry this or if I want to sell it. <laughs> I, it's really a super soft pebbled leather. Um, there are no feet on the bottom, no back pocket, like I said, but it's very spacious. The only thing is, um, on some parts, it, when it's not stuffed, it kind of collapses on itself. But other than that, it was a great carry. It's comfortable. It holds a lot. So let me give you an overview of what it looks like. It's a dark hole, as you can see. So I'll just start pulling stuff out as I see it. Okay, we have a mermaid pin, because you need a pin in every purse. You need a flashlight. Oh, I can't get it to work. <laughs> flashlight. And, and these are in the front, uh, the pockets, the two pockets, and it has my keys in it. Um, then we'll move on to a random receipt. We went to Rib Crib to eat. Really good barbecue. <laughs> Next, I have cotton candy body spray from Walmart. Travel spray. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but it smells really good. Uh, next is 
my Dr. Pepper Lip Smackers. One of my favorite lip smackers that oh smells just like Dr. Pepper. It's kind of bulky, but I knew it would fit in this bag, so I had to have it. Or we have another receipt. Oh, so I sold a bag. So I do buy and sell bags. It's not like I can, I have endless room to contain thousands of bags. So I did sell a bag. So that's my tracking receipt. Um, I decided to use my Longchamp little coin holder for actual coins. Has gold hardware and it's like a purple color. And next we have wet ones because these come in handy. <laughs> then I have more butter rums because they're delicious and I have a lot of them. And I have, okay, I have my Coach Nolita 15 in the black pebbled leather. I think everybody has seen these. They're very similar to the Louis Vuitton mini pochette. Um, I just have a bunch of stuff in here like Vicks Vapor, Breath Strips, <laughs> uh, some, some new lipstick. I got uh, LA Colors lipstick in there, a hand sanitizer, some ibuprofen and contact solution and a contact container. So I'm not going to grab all of that stuff, but yeah, this is a great catch-all bag where you can keep everything contained in one location. So yeah, Nolita 15. And then I have another receipt from Ross. And I got my daughter a heart little dress for Valentine's Day. And I also got something else that I can't remember right now. So yeah, Ross receipt. Then I put some extra pills in this Eiffel Tower pill container. It's really pretty. It has a cute design on it. Can't remember where I got this. I think someone that actually did go to Paris from a coworker a long time ago. And it just has three little spots for pills. Ibuprofen, Tylenol. So that's in there. Then for my wallet, I'm using this patent leather coach signature embossed. One of my favorite coach wall full size wallets. Not that I carry too many of full size wallets, but I do love this one. Um, and then here it just I have some cash and several cards. It holds a lot. Let me see. Probably, I don't know, 20 or 30 cards could fit in here, along with cash and coin, but I didn't use the coin. So I have that wallet. Oh, so we went to Olive Garden the other day, and I have a bunch of the Olive Garden mints. If you haven't had these, you need to go to Olive Garden. Well, not only for the breadsticks and salad. <laughs> they also give you these, uh, like, Andy's mints. They're really good. So I have a bunch of those. Hey, we're supposed to collect a bunch of stuff, and this is just my life in a week. So I found another butter rum and another mint. And then make, let me make sure that I've... Oh, okay. And then I also have my mirror just a just a mirror and let me see i don't think i have anything in the zipper pocket just the tag comparable price on here was 2.95 like i said i got it at marshall's for 89 dollars and 
quick look on the inside. There are the two slots right here and then a normal zip zipper pocket and black interior. So that is what I collected in a week in my bag. So not too crazy, but I wouldn't have had all those receipts if I was just showing you what's in my bag. So anyway, this was a fun collaboration. Hopefully I'm, I'm invited back for another collab of some sort, I hope. Um, but yeah, this has been a really good carry, really comfortable. Um, these are comfortable because they have the leather straps. So yeah, it was a good bag for the week challenge, definitely. So thank you again for putting that challenge out there, Yota. <laughs> and uh, go ahead and watch all of their videos because I know I'm going to. So yeah, if you like this kind of video, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And I wouldn't be mad at you. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you all have a great rest of your day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.